If you're a fan of Halo games, you have probably have dug into the lore or the universe of Halo and maybe ran into a couple of words that are a little more difficult to pronunciate without knowing a little bit of context. And yeah, over the years, I've said my fair share of mispronunciations, both in videos or just in casual conversations when it comes to Halo. And I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys probably have run into the same thing in one way or another. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of these common mispronunciations in Halo and try to figure out what's going on here and what is actually correct. This list is a mix of common misconceptions and also some interesting things I've heard along the way when playing through Halo and just kind of having voice chat turned on when you hear people just say stuff. First, let's look at Halo armor as a whole. The armor itself in Halo is called Mjolnir or a part of Project Mjolnir. It's spelled like this. And while you could have some slightly different variations on how you might pronounce that, it's definitely not Majolinir. So we just gotta clarify that right now. <laughs> also, while we're at it, this helmet from Halo 3 that was very popular is not Hayabusta. It's Hayabusa. This one's not as much as a mispronunciation as just a um, common mess up that I've even done in videos. But in Halo 3, this is a Hornet. In Halo Reach, this is a falcon, and in Halo 5, this is a wasp. None of these are pelicans, which is something I hear in games all the time. Those are the bigger ships that are more in the campaigns. Like I said, not a lot of people mispronounce these, but I kind of have to acknowledge it because I've messed up on this one all the time. This is another very common one, and hopefully no one feels too attacked right now by this, but these things are called machine gun turrets. I hear so many people say turrent with like an N. I'm pretty sure it's just a dialect type thing where some people just add a silent letter that's not there. Similarly to how a lot of people add a silent L in the word both, they'll pronounce it as both. I feel the same way with the word turret. So don't feel too personally attacked. This one's very common. One that not a lot of people actually even know about is that the dump truck thing in Halo 3 ODST is actually an oliphant. Also, this was one that I was in denial on for a very long time, even though it really Really does make sense, but the Warthog variant that shoots that super laser is actually pronounced Gauzhog, not Gauzhog. Seriously, I still will call it Gauzhog, and even knowing this is correct. This comes from the German physicist Johann Karl Friedrich Gauss, who theorized the magnetic effect used by magnetic accelerator cannons, which is what's used in coil guns and Gauss rifles. And then, of course, the idea of a Gauss rifle was then put on a Warthog, and then we have the Gauss cannon, thus making it a Gauss Hog. This is also confirmed in promotional material whenever you actually hear this vehicle being talked about. Still in my heart, it's Gauss Hog. I think I like it better because it rhymes. This next one's a little harder because we can't find any actual official pronunciation on this, but we can all agree that this helmet is either Gunganeer or Gungeoner, but it's definitely not Gun Gear. Also, this is the security helmet. Thank you very much. Not the secretary helmet. Not your secretary. This one was funny. One time I was pretending to not know anything about Halo and someone was explaining the whole story to me and told me that the main villain of the Flood is called Graveyard, you know, not Gravemind. And while we're at it, of course, it's the Arbiter, not the Arbitrator, even though that is clever because he kind of betrays the Covenant. Okay, this next one's not Halo exclusive, but it's one we see all the time, especially when it comes to spelling and pronunciations. And it is kind of weird. It just comes from the root of the words, but you actually spell Sergeant like this. It's not Sergeant and you don't spell Sergeant with an A. However, if you're just saying Sarge as in like an abbreviation or like a nickname. It's spelled like this with an A. Honestly, a lot of these ranking things are weird. This is actually pronounced Colonel and not as commonly messed up. A lieutenant is spelled with all of these vowels in a row. This is the EVA helmet, not the EVA helmet. It stands for extra vehicular activity, even though the characters we've seen in the Halo games wearing EVA don't really do too much with vehicles at all. This is actually a Puma. This is pronounced Oni, not Oni or O-N-I. And the planet in Halo 4 is pronounced Requiem, not Requiem or Requiem. This vehicle is not a Spectre. It's actually a Revenant, not a Reverent. Also another one that I've heard. Also another type of armor and a rank Brigadier. It's not Brigader. Now some of these can actually change based on what translation of the game you have and what they're saying. But for the most part, the canonical way to say the character June is in fact June, not Jun, which I've heard a lot of people say, especially in the earlier days when Halo Reach came out, people would refer to the character as Jun. And elites have a class called Zealot. It is not at all pronounced Zealot, like I hear so many squeakers say. Not that anyone really cares about the Prometheans too much, but these are actually called crawlers, though, you know, dogs work too. This one's kind of interesting, but 
with a fuel rod gun kind of switches between which Halo game it's in. Sometimes it's a fuel rod gun, other times it's a fuel rod cannon. So we don't really know where to go with this one. I've also heard a lot of people refer to Spartan Locke as Spartan Loki. No, the main dude from Halo Combat Evolve's name is actually Hello My Name Keys, not whatever else you call him. This level is called Epitaph, and this level, the Halo 3 version of course, is called Cut My Life Into Pieces. A lot of people call these things Sentinels, but they're actually Sentinels with an N before the T sound. So there's two N sounds in the right pronunciation. These are Scarabs, not Megazords, though I will also accept Megazord if I ever play with someone again who calls them Megazords. And of course, there's Tartarus at the end of Halo 2, even though a lot of people just call them Tartar Sauce because they don't even want to try. The big ship you get to fly in in Halo Reach is called a Saber. It's not Sabre, despite what The Office might tell you. Also, real quick, whenever I jump into matchmaking or custom games and I can hear my teammates calling to me, you know, asking me to maybe play better than I'm actually playing, my gamer tag is Rocket Ja. It's not Rocket John, whatever people say. I think they thought that because my service tag is J A H, like the last part of Elijah, my name, maybe they see the H as an N, but that doesn't make sense how it would be Rocket John spelled J A N. That doesn't work. I know this isn't a Halo one, but it's one that I'm just a little irritated on. Also, like the earlier one we talked about, there is the Grenadier helmet, but it's not the Grenader helmet. The third level from Halo 3. This one's great. It's pronounced Savo Highway, but I've heard many, many people call it Tasavo Highway with an overemphasis on the T sound. That is not the case. It's just Savo. In Halo 5, despite the fact that they say this many times in the game's voiceovers, still heard people call this level the Battle of Suna Eon. Yeah, I don't know. It's Battle of Sunion. And if you thought you were losing brain cells already hearing some of these mispronunciations, don't worry, we have more here. I remember back when Halo 3 ODST released, Halo 3 dropped the Mythic 2 map pack. And I remember talking to some kid who said that he wasn't a huge fan of the map Kitadel. Now, I'll agree with him, I didn't like the map Citadel either, but it's not pronounced Kitadel. Also, back at the end of Halo 1, when Chief asks if anyone else made it, Cortana is saying just Dust and Echoes, not Dust and Echoes. Dust and Echoes being, of course, the iconic character that he is. Another mispronunciation I've experienced back in the Halo Reach firefight days, someone said the level was called Glacier. Like, something can be glacier than you. The level's called Glacier. I think most people understand that though. This of course is the rogue helmet in Halo 3, not the rouge helmet. This character is called Mickey, not Mikey. This character is called George, not Jorge. Also, Halsey is not his mom. The extra hard challenge you can do with all skulls on is called Lasso, not Laso, though this one technically could be up for debate. Just a pet peeve. It's actually not important. When Halo Reach came out, a lot of people were calling the needle rifle the needler rifle. And I mean, another one that's not that important, but it's the needle rifle. No R. In Halo 2, there's a skull called the Recession Skull, and I've heard it be called Rekeshen. I don't even know how to pronounce what they called it. Rekeshen Skull. Also, before Halo 4 came out, a lot of people were speculating about who the mysterious villain character would be, or in early discussions after Halo 4 released, a lot of people referred to the Didact as the Didact <laughs> just sounds dumb. In Halo Reach, when we switch to the darker color scheme that is in that game, I've seen people call this color Orchid, even though it's Orchid, and this color Cayenne, like the pepper, even though it's Cyan. And then if we go all the way back to the Halo 1 days, we have two maps that have caused many, many problems for many people over the years. And this is one I can't fault you too much if you've mispronounced along the way, because honestly, I had to look it up for this video. Now, a lot of people pronounce this one as Chiron but it's actually pronounced Chiron, which is a word that comes from Greek mythology. Now, this word on your screen is the name of one of the levels in Halo 1 as well, which actually means fear of bridges. I swear, if you just put this word in front of anyone, it probably is one that's gonna get mispronounced the first time around. No, it's not Jeffrey Phobia, even though that'd be way easier to say. It's actually Jephyrophobia, and I'm still not absolutely positive on my pronunciation of that. But yeah, if Jephyrophobia is your favorite level, now you might be able to say it properly. So we kind of want to turn this around to you guys. Obviously, a lot of these ones were probably ones you knew to an extent. Hopefully there were a couple in there that surprised you. Hopefully you have some experience with other people who've pronounced things in a very interesting way whenever you talk to your friends about Halo or whatnot. And if you have any interesting ones we might have missed that you've encountered, please leave a comment down below. I just feel like the comment section will be hilarious based off of that alone. Oh, also the Master Chief is actually pronounced Mr. Chief, just saying. But hey, if you liked this video, can you take a quick moment first 
double check you are in fact subscribed down below with notifications on. It helps us out a lot. We get to do more stuff like this and that's cool. Also, if you want to talk with us on Twitter, you can follow me at Rocket Elijah and you can also follow Luke at Rocket Sloth Luke. So feel free to follow us on there and communicate with us a bit. We would kind of appreciate it. But otherwise, that's it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you all next time.